Hi, I'm Penny and I'm the co-founder of Bloomness. Okay, so what we do is we deliver handcrafted designer flowers and also gifts on demand and also via subscription. And our whole mission of doing this is to create moments of happiness. Okay. When we first started the business, we were very fascinated by technology especially its ability to solve complex problems and improve people's life. Women generally face um, numerous challenges in various areas, especially in the tech industry. And I think one of it is definitely the unconscious bias towards female in the marketplace. I wrote an article back in November last year and I shared a few areas that can help women thrive in the challenging yet fulfilling business journey. Firstly, as a woman, uh, we need to refuse to be intimidated. Secondly, is to um, look into high value segments and how we can grow boldly into it. Um, it is also very important to get trained and also leverage on support groups. I love sharing about our apprenticeship program that we started during the pandemic. We noticed that a lot of people lost their jobs due to the business closures and lockdown. So we came up with the idea of upskilling women or men who are interested in the floral and gifts arrangement. We managed to organize so many batches of apprenticeship program where the participants actually get paid for learning. And upon the completion of the program, they get an opportunity uh, for a job uh, placement in Bloom This. We are very proud to say that the program has enabled so many people in, acquire, uh, in acquiring new skills and given hope to them during the challenging times. Some of these participants uh, whom we train has also become our staffs and some even progress from one role to another. My work life and personal life Fortunately or unfortunately, it's very much intertwined because I run a business together with my husband who is the co-founder and the CEO of the company. I can't say that I enjoy that husband-CEO relationship all the time, but I'm glad that both of us are coping well. Uh, women need to build your self-confidence. And confidence comes from being competent. And to be competent is to constantly seek knowledge, execute, make mistakes, learn from it, and rise again. I have deep admiration for one of my mentors, whose name is Alice Lopin. I have the privilege to get to know uh, Alice from one of the female founder programs organized by uh, AWS and Tiger Hall uh, sometime last year. Alice taught me a lot on leadership development, which focuses on work cultures that can elevate employee engagement and performances. Oh, I think the future is promising, but there is still a lot of work to be done. I think we should continue to advocate for diversity and inclusion. We should always support one another and create opportunities for all of us to succeed together. Happy International Women's Day. Go out there and make a dent.